Here we go again, people. Back again with Ark Survival Evolved. I am Madtown213 here with my brother Josh, and we are going to deliver on a promise, I hope, to get a Mosasaur today. Took us a long time to find one, but we got it. Um, so how do you want to do... I think we should both trank. Um... Like, Should we figure out how high it can go? <laughs> I think we're good, like, here. What the hell's going on with my... Ple I don't know what's happening with my plesiosaurs. It's glitching. Alright, so we have many, many arrows, many, many narcotics. I have seven Quetzal Kibble, which should help speed this up a little bit. And then I got... We've got two Nessies. I think this is good. Uh, put, put your guys on not follow... And passive. We want him just. Uh, I'm putting my neutral because this one's about to die. Oh, okay. Well, if you get bit, it's gonna attack that mosasaur. Well, I shouldn't. <laughs> That's Actually, why I wanted to yeah. test it. I wanted to test its ceiling. All right. So, well, that's pretty high. Oop! Up! 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 All right, so I'm firing first arrow. It's kind of cool, like green brownish. I usually when I see them, they're like dark black. So just unload. We've got plenty of arrows. Even if you're not 100% hitting it, just fire, fire, fire. Oh, the, the only thing that sucks is we're kind of far away from the. Get up! Oh, get boy. up! Get up! Oh, oh. I'm going. Okay, so this is its ceiling. <laughs> yeah, I'm thinking we're good if we just stay here. And just pray. Oh, it's going higher. Or maybe I went lower. Yep. <laughs> oh, I got to go up. Wow, why is it going so high? Or am I just falling really, really? What is going on? All right, so... Oh, I didn't even look at how many arrows I started with. And we don't even know what level this thing is, do we? No. Where are you at? I'm right above it. L literally right above it. Oh, I'm standing right next to you, dude. <laughs> no, I just swam over oh. to you. I thought we had, like, our backs to each other or something. Come here. Where are you going, buddy? And if we need to run back to Nessie's to get change out bows or something, we should probably take turns so we can always keep firing into it. Mm-hmm. Oh, what's biting something? That thing is absolutely gigantic. Yeah, I can't. I really, really hope we get this thing. Uh oh. Alright, come on, buddy. I'm good so far, so if you want to go to the. do what you need to do, maybe switch out a bow or grab an extra one and some arrows, just to make sure. Because I'm going to need to get another bow here quick. I don't know if I have another one on. Where, where do we have all the extra bows? On my Nessie. Or your Nessie, or. I don't know if how many. I, you grabbed two or three, didn't you? I grabbed two. Okay. But I am. Yeah, I'm starving. I gotta get up. No, don't go away. Come here, dude. Alright, I'm a little low. Yeah, I don't like where I'm at. Ah, run! Oh, baby. No, please don't bite me. Please don't bite me. Oop, I'm right to see what level it is. Oh, I missed it. I think it's a single digit. Although it doesn't, it's kind of like a giga. It doesn't really matter what level it is. Yeah. Uh-oh, uh-oh. No, 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 no. Shoot, shoot, shoot. Nope, get up, get up. Oh my gosh. Oh, and then it's night. Are you kidding me? 
Yeah. This went from bad to worse. Come on, please go down. Just please go down. Uh, do you still know where the Nessies are? Yeah. Like, are we right still now. close? Yeah. Okay. Oh, where are you going, dude? Yeah, I'm going to need to switch out bows. Are you fed and can you come down? Yeah. Uh oh. No! I don't know. Ah! Where are you? Oh, there you are. He is on my nutsack. Okay, it's a six or a five or something. Where did it go? Oh. Yeah, my bow is almost... Wait, do I have an extra bow on me? Sweet. I got one. Never mind. I'm not leaving. Oh, is it is down? down? Is it down? It's... I think so. Yeah, it's down. Level five. Whatever. Don't care. Female, yeah. too. <laughs> All right, so we'll throw... Dude, that thing is... Shoot, I don't have... Gnarly. Hang on, I gotta run to my pleasy and get the kibble. Because I did not want to lose that Quetzal kibble. That is a gnarly-looking dinosaur. Yeah. All right, I'm gonna bring both these guys down. Closer. I mean, you can actually swim up its mouth. Oh, really? Yeah. Wait, are they... I'm going to put them on passive. I don't know if they'll attack something that's knocked out for meat. Just in case. All right, so everybody stop moving around. All right, so let's get Quetzal Kibble. Oh, and by the way, uh, people, we have also got a... Uh, an angler fish earlier on too. It was what like a level sixty something. Yep. All right. Oh, uh, so depending, I don't know. How, we'll see how this kibble works out, but um, we may not need to go get prime. Well, I can, I can work on that. All right. So luckily, there's a bunch of plesiosaurs that were just down that we passed getting here. So. We're not too far away, and I forgot to start my time. I think we've been in about what five minutes or so. Yep. All right. So. I really don't want to leave because <laughs> it's gonna oh, be impossible to find, to find me. You yeah. Again. Well, let's see how. Okay. So, two levels. Well, I suppose it's only level five. Okay. So it is about a sixth tamed. And we've got six more kibble left. So, let's wait mm -hmm. until the last minute. Well, not last, last minute, but... Um, hmm, how can we do this? Because we don't have GPSs on either of us. And it's nighttime, so oh. we can't really see where we're at. I'll go back a little bit. I was going to say, let's yeah. I can. Stay low to the... Um, ground and like look right below us and try to find like some type of uh, something you can you'll know a landmark that's right below us and then just follow the floor and now we just have to pray that sharks and nessies don't find us Man, this thing is huge. Huge, huge, huge. Oh, look at its Do you see its eyes? They're like white. Yeah, it looks really cool. All right, so I'm going to... i got to get a screenshot of that. Oh, that's not what I wanted. I'm going to see if I can do a K mode right underneath its mouth. Oh, yeah. Dope. Oh, that's going to be horrible because it's so dark. Oh, well. So, we got one. Awesome. So far, so good. So, the whole point of this episode was to find and get a Mosasaur, and we are part of the way there. We found one. We have one down. 
Now the whole, we gotta finish it off. I think those seven quit, Quetzal Kibble might just, we are, we're actually lucky we did find one this low of level. Yeah, I got, I just got like 30 some prime, so we should right. be right. So it's three Kibble in and it's halfway tamed and we have four left. <clears throat> So it's it's either going to just tame out or need one piece of prime. One of those two options. So this is pretty cool. This is actually the third wild one I've seen. And this is the first one for you, right, Josh? Yep. Because I killed one when they first came out because I just went to go find one. I knew I wasn't going to be able to tame it by myself, so I just took a plesiosaur and killed it, but... This is going to be dope. The other one I saw was dark, dark black. Like, almost, yeah. Dark brown, black-ish. Man, these things are huge. And then, I think we'll probably have to do a mini episode of leveling this bad boy up. So you might as well just throw the prime on him. Because he will, uh, he will prioritize kibble first. So, eighteen hundred, right. so two thousand would be fifty. That should get us right where we need to be. We already had one near disaster. We were taming that angler fish before, and five more angler fish killed me. And Josh wasn't anywhere near me, so we almost lost all the kibble and all the air or a bunch of arrows, bunch of crossbows. But we got lucky for once ever. Actually, we've been kind of yeah. lucky underwater, because when we got those plesiosaurs, that was extremely lucky. Yeah. Because we found three. Came like three. Yeah, all in the same circle, and not a single shark or any other plesiosaur like came to mess with us at all. Yeah. Yeah, we've actually gotten on a pretty good hot streak. We tamed that female Giga almost drama-free, except for that Spino, which wasn't too much. And then... What else? And then this, and those pleasies. Because this wasn't bad. This was relatively anticlimactic. Yeah, it was a lot, a lot easier than I kind of thought it would be. It is a level 5, though. So. Yeah. Um, yeah, hopefully this tames up. I guess I could cut. I just got new video editing software that I haven't tried out yet. So, you know what? Well, we're almost, it's almost done, to be honest. And the whole point of this episode was to get the moss. And I don't have a saddle yet for it, so... Yeah. Um, oh, it's almost done. Two kibble left, and it's seven-eighths tame, so... Uh, that prime, it'll just eat that. So we can go ahead, and I'll just dump these extra narcotics on them for the hell of it. We got plenty. Make sure he eats fast. And it's a female, so yeah, it's only a level five. But if we, oh, we can't mate water animals yet, anyways. Still, this is what you only need: what angler and mosasaur. That was all you needed, right, for dossiers? And then that mysterious uh, one. Yep. Yeah. Oh wait, no, you need an avaraptor too. Oh yeah, but that, there's that, so many of those yeah. running around. <laughs> So that'll be it. You'll complete. And I would have completed if they didn't erase them for me like three times. I want to ride this thing. <laughs> well, let's see what the... Uh... Oh, you know what? It's guaranteed to be in a fabricator, Smithy. I can't even see what... Actually, I could look up online. There it is. You got it. Mosasaur. Beast mode. Cool. Alright, so... 
Um, I'm going to put this is mad slash JPs. Because this is the only one we've got so far. So we'll split it up depending on what, we, what do you want to name it. It's a female. Something mm. with an M. Uh, I don't know. Melanie? Molly? Sure. <laughs> Melanie the Moss? No. How about Molly? Molly the Mossasaur? Yeah. Are you down with that? That'll work. All right. Yep. Cool. So we got Molly. Oh, that's that drug that all the kids do, too. All right. <laughs> um, so this is, yeah, Molly, Molly. Let's put her on neutral. Let's grab our pleasey and head to the surface and get a check. Head, let's check this thing out on land or closer to land. There's a couple. Head to these two double drops, Josh. Yep. We'll see if we can't. Oh, we're not even anywhere close. And I'm hungry. And I have no food. Do you have any? What the hell's? Get him, Molly. Yeah. Oh, there's shark. I'm gonna just let Molly take care of these sharks. If she can do it. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, yeah, sweet. All right, you know what? There's, I still got like 10 minutes left in this episode. I'm going to try out this new video editing software that I did get. So I'm going to cut here, and we'll come back once we get it's daytime, and I get a saddle, and we're going to go ride this damn thing and level it up. So uh, I will be back when we have a saddle in the daytime. And we're back. We got Molly a fancy new saddle. And it is now daytime, so let's go and have some fun and level her up. Let's actually check what her base level is. 4,000 health, 480 stamina. I'm assuming that's probably giga-like. Probably not very good. Food, 99. That seems like a lot. <clears throat> 1300 weight, 264 melee, 100% movement speed. So let's start with, well, let's take her out first and see what she's like before we decide what we're going to level her up in. Uh, why can't we go anywhere? Am I still in K mode? Oh, yeah. All right, so let's go eat some shit and see what she's all about. Well, super slow. So the only experience I've had with these guys is killing them. I've killed two, so not really sure. So this is a new experience for me. What do we got here? Ooh, a perfect, perfect example. Let's see what they do to a pleasey. I hope I'm not hitting it, because if I'm hitting that's weak. I know it's only a level 5, but... We're definitely going to have to go out and get a different one, because if their thing is power, she sucks. Oh, shoot. I forgot. I didn't grab a scuba tank, so I'm going to run out of oxygen. All right. I have one here on the boat, so let me grab that real quick, and we'll head back out. I do about 10 minutes worth. And if you see things just floating out here, those are the ones that I had. Yeah, whatever. Um, that I wanted to get rid of. And instead of just waiting for them to starve, I figured I'd just throw them out here and let the sharks have them. So all I need is a scuba tank. Because, oh, that's not what I wanted. Let's go ahead and grab just one of these. Doesn't really matter. Scuba tank. All right. So we'll get back on her now that we can breathe underwater. And let's see. I'm assuming this is probably going to be a bad experience for me because she is such a low level. 
I mean, if I rode a level 5 Raptor, or level 5 RG, or level 5 anything, I probably would think they all the dinosaurs suck. So I have to make sure that I'm objective as possible. I guess she's not that slow. I mean, compared to a dolphin or an angler. Oh, and I'll show you guys the angler too. We got about, yeah, we'll do about eight minutes of this. As long as I can find some stuff. And then I'll show you guys. Oop, they're perfect. What do we got here? A bunch of pleasies. Let's go ahead and munch on. Actually, I'm just going to sit still and let them come to me. All right, so she can tank, which I like. So even though she's not killing them very much, she can take some damage. So, because she's just getting, there's the 35. Ooh, a 72, please. Ooh, I sh should have checked the levels. Are you even hitting it? Yeah. Must be glitch or lag. All right, so she can tank. I mean, that was a 72 plesiosaur with a buddy. And it only took about a third of my life. So, yeah, that's not bad. I can only imagine what a big one of these things can do. Let's go find some more lunch. The anglerfish, though. Those, I can't believe how many arrows those things take to put down. For such a small little thing. I mean, the one we got is like a level 64 uh, wild. And I could have swore it took 50 to 60 arrows. Which is pretty absurd. But they are really cool and super fast. Yeah, I don't know. So she needs work. She needs a lot of work. But she is a female, so sounds like they should be getting water amphibian creatures done by the first of the year hopefully so we will uh, hang on to her to at least get some breeding started because Josh and I went I would say at least halfway around the island before we found this one so it seems as though they are giga ish rare and quetzal ish rare Ooh. Oh, I'll let you just leave you alone. You can go ahead and eat those. So she's fun, um, but she needs some work. So we're going to wait on her. Uh, slow down. We'll get her up here nice and close. Get her out of the water a bit. All right. So that is Molly. I like her color. That's cool. Like I said, most of the ones I've seen are like dark colors, either browns or blacks or grays. This is kind of cool. I'm digging the, the green, considering that matches Hulk or Giga. He's almost almost a di identical color, so that's cool. Um, so let's go ahead and check. Okay, so we got another... We're going to need melee, for sure. Oh, we got a couple levels. Nice. And, yeah, that should be good. This will all rot. I don't care about any of this. Yeah, that's fine. We'll just leave that there. I already filled up the uh, bin from all the meat we had on the pleasies, so should be good there. Not sure what we're going to call the angler yet. <clears throat> Super psyched about this though. He is fast. Is it a he? Yep. All right. So let's get him out of this area. The other thing I love is that you don't need saddles. Love the animals that don't need saddles. I think that's super awesome. Wolves, um, gorillas, the gigantopit. Let's see if we can get his face out of the water. Yeah, so he's pretty dope. His little lights match kind of his colors, like a purple-ish, purpley blue. So level 88, we haven't leveled him up yet. So this is base stats. So let's, oop. 
Let's go ahead and check what he's all about. 1620 health, 480 stamina, 4,000 food. That's a ton. We'll have to run the, the taming calculator on these guys and see what wasted stats got thrown. I, I'm assuming food a bunch in him. That just seems really high for such a small creature. 427 weight, 354 melee, and 100% movement speed. And I don't know that we're ever going to tame a dolphin anymore because these guys are fast. We had to, when I was swimming them back. And he can do damage. Like, what's the point of a dolphin? Let's go mess with that shark and see what we can do. And anywhere near this base is going to lag and skip like that, so I apologize. We'll try to do a lot of more stuff outside of the base. All right, let's see what we can do to this shark. What level are you, first of all? Okay, first problem I can already see is stamina. And super lag. Whoa, where'd you go? All right, face to face, let's do this. All right, we're not really bloodying him yet. Stop running in circles, dude. Fight. You're a shark, man. Alright, so we took a bite. And lost about an eighth life. So we'll definitely need to boost health. I think it was only at 1k, so that's understandable. Well, let's just see what level you are first before we get too far into this. Okay, he's starting to do some damage. All right. That shark is... Knocked about a half of the life off. I don't know if I'm not hitting him or if his bites are just that weak. I mean, it is a shark, and I don't know what level it is, so that could be possible, but... All right, we got some blood. Come on. Okay. I don't think we're going to be able to mess with him. I don't know what level this is, but we're at half, and he's only hit us like three times. I don't know if I'm in the box, the hitbox, or what. But the shark does not. Well, this is a level 88, so I don't know if we just got a, a lemon. Or, like, if this stat, dude's stats aren't thick. I'm going to have to do some research on these guys, so... Normally I'll only do research on stuff that I have or I'm planning on going to get, but this was kind of impromptu. Uh, we haven't been underwater in a long time, and now that I got all the underwater creatures here, we just kind of was like, hey, let's go get a Mosasaur and some Anglers. So I'll have to check on stat research to see what these guys' base damage and stuff is, because if I have to chase a shark around for fuck that, I'm done. That's pointless. He's not going to kill whatever level shark that was. So, But he's fast. They seem useful. Um, I'm definitely... How many we got left? We got one scorpion. Two scorpions left. So it ate two raptors and two other scorpions. So this these guys will be fun. I'm definitely planning on getting a lot more of these. Um, I'd like to have a little mini army of these guys. Maybe... I don't know. A dozen? Something like that? Let's go ahead and stick him over here. And let's just get whatever he's got on. Oh, nothing. Alright, so health. It took about half our health. I think we definitely need to go up in health. One level. 2,000. Alright. So we're going to do some playing around with him in the future for sure. And getting some more. And making a little Dimorphodon of the Sea Army with these guys so that'll be fun um, so you guys can look forward to that in the near future definitely be doing now that we got one Mosasaur I am kind of interested in what the higher level ones will do so we'll probably be looking for more of those and gonna name this dude um, a male blue angler hmm I don't know I'll have to think about that and maybe have him named next episode 
So, uh, let's hope this editing software stuff works. This is the f first time I've cut a video because I wasn't able to before. So, we'll see how that works out. Uh, hope you guys enjoyed the underwater adventures today and the previous two videos of the base tour and the Rex migration. Um, we're going to be doing a lot more of that type of stuff of getting out and about and away from home so look forward to that in the future hope you guys enjoyed and we'll see you next time